first impression really lasts. From the title itself, I felt that this is the most challenging course. Indeed, I am certainly right. Challenging at the same time demanding due to the weekly requirements. Technical writing is far different from news writing, which I'm used to. There were times that I really wanted to give up, but I persisted because this is my last semester. I've given this more priority than my thesis. The requirements and tasks were hard, but all were appropriate to be able to grasp a better understanding of this course. Searching and annotating open access and peer-reviewed journals quite challenged my patience. I realized that science is not really free. They say that most of the things you read on the internet are junk, but with journals being peer-reviewed, we could ensure the quality. For the discussion forums, I procrastinated most of the time, but I was able to participate in all discussion forums. This course and my job are both demanding, so there's really a need for proper time management. I did a lot of research because I couldn't compose a paragraph without being supported by several references. I enjoyed reading some insights and sharing my thoughts to my classmates. My favorite part of the course is creating a virtual group report. I love my group mates. We are all cooperative and creative. I learned a lot in video editing, though this is not actually part of the course objectives. The topic assigned to us was about the gap between academics and practice of science communication. I realized the importance of incorporating science communication in the academe. I'm bothered with the current status of the Philippines when it comes to science and technology. I know we have great scientists. They just lack support and exposure. For the policy brief, I'm not quite sure if I did it right, but I hope it could help our congressman in crafting a bill that would solve our garbage problem, which is bothering us for almost a decade now. Science, when communicated properly, is a powerful tool in policy making. It's good to find out that our congressmen are really spending millions for consultations. I hope scientific consultation is among them. This course helped me realize that my work as a journalist should be taken into the next level. Honestly, most of our stories are focused on crime, politics, and controversies. These are the things we think interest our viewers. However, we hold the responsibility of informing the public of things that would greatly affect their lives, like climate change. We should feed them with what they need and not with what they want. This course had become an eye-opener for me of what public service really is.